alrighty, what we are gonna do today is we are gonna do a versus video between the Hilti and the DeWalt, both brushless hammer drills. The Hilti is gonna have an eight amp hour battery and the DeWalt is gonna have a nine amp hour battery flex volt. And so I've been waiting to do this for this test for a long time and now I can. So both of these batteries are <clears throat> exceptionally powerful and this is more of an even match uh, compared to the last uh, episode that I did with these two against each other. Now there was a two amp hour difference in between the last video. Now there's only one and they both of them are very powerful batteries. So this is gonna be a good match. But let's look at the specs really quick then get to the test. All right, so really quick, uh, the DeWalt is DCD996. We are not using the hammer feature in this one. This test is for wood. So we'll just go over the specs without the hammer feature. Uh, this is a half inch metal chuck, uh, three speed settings. On speed one, it is zero to 450 RPMs. Speed two, zero, zero to 1300 RPMs. And on speed three, zero to 2000 RPMs. And it is 708 inch pounds of torque. All right, so for the Hilti, it, the model number is SF6HA22. Uh, it is 708 inch pounds of torque, two speed settings. First speed setting is zero to 490 on speed two, zero to three, uh, zero to 2000. Eight amp hour battery, nine amp hour battery. As you can see, eight amp hour battery is full. Nine amp hour flex, battery is full. So let's get to the test. All right, remember while you're working, wear safety gloves and safety glasses. Got mine right here. So to, we are introducing uh, a speed bore, an Irwin one and one quarter inch speed bore to this uh, these tests. That is a thing of beauty. So that will be added to these tests. Now in this test, we're going to stick to just pretty much uh, drill bits. We are not going to do any screws in this test. There's no need to. We start out small. We're gonna do a one inch spade bit. I love that ratchet. We are using speed three. Battery is on full. We're gonna do two holes. And then we're gonna move on to the Hilti. Ready, go. All right, one more hole. Ready, go. That is fast. You can feel, you just can feel that power. All right, let's see how the Hilti performs. Speed two on drill. Ready, go. I feel like the DeWalt did a little bit better on that one. All right, so ready, go. Go. Yeah, this bit's getting dull. This bit is getting dull. All right, so this bit is now garbage. That test is a that test is a failure. We're gonna go to the speed bore. The, neither of those get the first cut. We're gonna use the Ryobi, a three amp hour compact HP battery. This battery has 21,700 cells in it. We are not gonna uh, time this. Okay, got that on drill. All right, speed two, speed one. Right, this is gonna be a good test. All right, I think I'm gonna need the handles for this one. Never mind on that. All right, let's see if this is capable of doing it on speed three. It might not. All right, so ready, go. Okay. 
That's on speed three. Well, it succeeded, but it stopped. So let's see if the Hilti could do it without. Let's see if the Hilti could do it without stopping. All right, so it's on drill, speed two. Do it right here. Let's see if Hilti could do it without stopping. All right, so ready, go. Yes, it can. Maybe speed three is too too fast for it. All right, so ready, go. All right, so that's that's speed two. As you can see, speed two. All right, we're gonna do the, that one more time with the Hilti and see what the time is against speed two. All right, so ready, go. Flawless. Alrighty, so that is the speed bore. Let's do one and one eighth. We're going back to speed three. Speed three because it's capable. All right, so ready, go. Time. Then drill, yep. Ready, go. All right, so let's see what this can do. Speed three. I'm gonna try to do it smoothly. Ready, go. There we go. Time. All right, we are on speed two. So, ready, go. Time. Yeah, like you can tell that there's a major power difference for both Hilti and DeWalt with this bat with these batteries. We're gonna do the half inch spade self-driving bit and we're gonna do the speed bore on the six by six pressure treated wood. And so we are gonna do the DeWalt first. Uh, the battery life is still full. Huge benefit of the nine amp hour battery compared to the lower ones. Ready, go. And there we go. Better life is still full. Speed one, it's on drill. All right, so ready, go. That built up a little too much around the rim. All right, slowly take it out. All right, so uh, it's on drill, speed one. All right, so ready, go. Time. All right, so. So ready, go. Time. Yeah, with this, it builds up fast. All right, so speed three, it's on drill. Ready, go. That was fast. Oh. All right, so ready, 
Go. Time. It's awesome. All right, and for the final test, we are going to do the speed bore on speed two. So, ready? Go. Oh, okay, that's right. All right, so speed two for the speed bore. All right, so ready? Go. Time. All right, so ready? Go. Time. Both of these drills are seriously, seriously awesome. So that pretty much concludes the test for the nine amp for the Dewalt. 9 amp hour flex volt versus the Hilti 8 amp hour regular battery. Uh, the, both of these drills are seriously, seriously awesome. You cannot go wrong with them. These two aren't done yet. We still have to do a metal and concrete test uh, for these. You know, and that along with the different sized uh, amp hour and special batteries. So endless videos coming up. You guys see my wall. I have a ton of video a uh, ton of tools which equals out to a ton of videos i'm getting more tools too i'm not done buying i will always get the latest and greatest for the stuff so please subscribe to the channel and this is dave nicholas thank you for tuning in and i'll see you guys next time